This clip is brought to you by SaveWithConrad.com. Well, somebody else who uh, made some waves in MMA and uh, maybe you were the perfect opponent for him since you had a little bit of showmanship in you from pro wrestling was Kimbo Slice, a rather controversial name in MMA. Uh, what do you remember about your uh, dust up with Kimbo? Yeah, I thought, you know, it was, it was, again, I was disappointed to hear him pass because I felt like he was just starting to find his way. He was just starting to get himself in a position to be able to take his family and move into a different environment. Um, and it's sad when you see people that are literally starting to get themselves where they need to be, to be able to change their lives. And I felt that's what Kimbo was trying to do. And it just fell short. One last question before we start to wind things up here. You're back these days in Impact Wrestling. What's old is new again. You were on their very first show, the very first world champion in Impact in 2002 here in Huntsville, Alabama. And now you're back there now. Are you enjoying your time in Impact? It's sort of fun to see you back there. Yeah, it is. It's fun. It, it, it's just a bunch of hungry kids that are just trying to find their way. And there's a lot of talent there and they're starting to get a lot more talent from area, other places because it seems like there's so many wrestlers out there. There's just not enough, enough slots for everybody, but there's a couple organizations that are literally out there on TV. Um, it gives these guys a chance to go to these places and still work and still get seen. So I love the, the idea that there's multiple um, areas for these guys go to work so I was excited to be there. I really enjoyed my time there. I thought these guys, along with Scott Moore, they, I mean, I thought they did a great job of putting things together and I was much appreciated for what they did for me. Awesome. Ken, we want to thank you for coming on the Kurt Angle show. Is there anything you want to say to your fans out there that still follow your career? Yeah, I just want to say I appreciate um, all the support over the years. I really did enjoy the fans. I think that was uh, always the uh, first and foremost to me was I always wanted to make sure the fans enjoyed, whether it was in USD or in pro wrestling, that they enjoyed what I was doing, and it always made a difference to me. So for that, I thank them for the support. Even the ones that didn't support me, that's what made it fun. So I appreciate you, and thank you, and uh, yeah, God bless. Hey, hey, it's Conrad Thompson. Thanks for checking out the podcast here on YouTube. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notifications bell so you get a notice anytime we upload some new content. And go save yourself some money right now. If you're in a 30-year loan or you have credit card debt, it's not a matter of if I can save you money. It's a matter of how much. Find out right now for free at SaveWithConrad.com.